Do it! Focus on the shield! The shield is all you need! The shield is all you need! You don't need the dog! Regain the shield! Hoorah! Hey guys, it's jacksparrow 123 and today we're not on the Gaming Evolve server, we're on this game called Survivor and today we're going to be testing it out because it was on sale on Steam so I figured why the heck not. Now, what I get from this game is it's a weird game, like, I played it a little bit before because I know the buttons. Okay, first of all, just to look at that guy's face. No, 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 no. It's so weird. It's like it's trying to be a game of Doho with like the hitting areas. Press C the fire, try to destroy. It has pretty good, good like movement speeds and stuff like the animations. Now what I get from this game is that it's like a space defender. Now first time I played this game, I'm not going to lie, I didn't read the arrow key movements. So I was just sitting still the whole time. Okay guys, we're going to try this game out on insane difficulty on the first little tiny thing. Oh, they have different types of ships. Let's do this one. I like the look of little wave beams. Oh gosh! I can see why this is on such a difficult mode. Okay, I don't know if this was a smart idea. Why would I do the hardest difficulty first? Oh gosh! The Toho aspect is real in this game. To anyone who doesn't know what Toho is, it's a game pretty much just like this with demons and stuffs. I know, I don't play it much, it's my family that does. I'm not dealing damage! More damage is required here. Well, I leveled up. That's a good thing. I was a little late to say it. Oh gosh. No, no blonde. I'm not very good at ship games. What? Like... The game's trying really hard to be Toho. I died. I stopped moving and I died. You see, I'm good at games. Let's do it on normal difficulty now. I like fast firing speed. Laser Gatling. Laser. Let's do this one. Yeah. Oh gosh. I know I'm not very good at commentary. I should just do videos without commentary. But my mind's kind of focused in this game. Not kind of focused, really focused. It does what I think the game wants to do and makes you think, which is kind of good, but in some aspects it's bad, cause say you're trying to do commentary like I am to show off this game, it doesn't help much. Oh my gosh, what have I done?
The poor ships. They were just flying around happily until I arrived. Back to Survivor or whatever. I got an achievement. I didn't get to read it. I am really bad at this game. My brothers would be fine at it. Oh gosh. Now it does do something that Toho doesn't do and allows you to switch the way you shoot which I really like because I have played many games like this and I can't aim for the world. Oh gosh. Why is everything going crazy? Just focus on regaining the shield me. Focus on the shield. Don't focus on the dog, focus on the shield. Focus on the shield. Do it! Focus on the shield! The shield is all you need! The shield is all you need! You don't need the dog! Regain the shield! Hoorah! Oh gosh, right behind. Not from the butt! I don't like it that way! And game over. I died. Darn it, dog! It's your fault. Let's do arcade mode. Easy mode this time. Post in the comments what kind of ship you want me to use. You want me to use, uh... Wide type? Well, too bad. We're doing the energy type. Again. Have we done this one? No. But look at these shots. Aren't they just spectacular and shiny? All I have to do is sit all the way back here, and then life is good. Look at it! Look at the powers! Feel the power of the jack! Feel it! Do you feel it, Mr. Krabs? Are you feeling it? Yeah! Destroying life with ships of destruction! Cause ships are powerful and stuff. I shoot a laser beam. Doom. The laser beam of doom. Oh goodness. Not this part again, please. My computer can't take it. I'm kidding. My computer can handle this game easy piece. Let's shoot. Shoot. Come on. Destroy all the enemy ships. Don't let a single one survive. All of them have no choice but to lose to me. But now my shield is down, so now I have a choice that I can lose to them. Vice versa. Oh gosh. Life is hard. Back down the one times. I want to see the ships, like, at max level if their attacks change or something. I really hope they do. But on arcade mode, it doesn't seem like the ships even level up. Unless all of those little square thingies that I keep picking up are, like, damage enhancers. I hate those jets. They take, like, three shots to kill. So, from what I'm gathering from this game, it's very action-packed. Which, I don't mind. I wish it told me that inside of the description of the game when I bought it. Now, I do think this is an indie game. So, like, the actor character thingies are really poorly made. If anything that can be done to that game, I'd say work on that. And then add, like some more ship types because I like different ships I like variety in games I like having an option oh gosh and now I'm back at it new level let's not do this now oh shoot I click continue wait controls one sec one sec I'll be back in one second I want to see if I can do this Okay guys, we're back. I set up my gaming controller to this game now. And there's lots of noise. Please ignore it. I know I'm a poor YouTuber. 
Let's do some more survival. Continue anyways. Let's go easy difficulty. I don't want a player to. Darn it. Survival. Easy. I like to look at this thing. Look at it. Watch. Look at it. It has a, like rapid fire sprays. Quick sprays that do damage. I'm guessing these shots do lots of damage if they're only a quick burst. Now, I wonder what they could do if they were like rapid, you know? What else can I do? Oh, I can swap it with my LB or whatever. I'm using a PS3 controller for anyone wondering. So, yeah. It's not as insane as I remember it. Oh yeah, that's because I'm on easy difficulty. After a few years, I might actually get good at this game and then I can do another video on it. Oh gosh, and I took damage. Damage is no blonde. No blonde means no good, I think. I'm pretty sure. You see, I'm using words that I don't know, so for all I know, I could be swearing. Yeah. Let's just let that sink in for a second. Okay, that second is up. Let's continue destroying life. I, I'm not really sure how to play games like this. All I know is that I'm really bad at games in general. What the heck was that little beam? If I go like this, everything should die. Oh gosh, we're getting hits. We're taking damage. Mayday, mayday. Okay, I'm not going to go into a whole roleplay thing. I'm not good at that kind of stuff. I'm sorry if I'm quieter. It's just I've moved a little bit further from my mic though. Hope that you guys can't hear my game controller. Also, my chair is leaned back, so hee <laughs> hee, I'm comfy. There's lots of explosions in this game. Oh gosh, those were ships, I thought they were missiles. Oh gosh. This game's not hard. It It's kind of enjoyable. For the price it is, I'd say it's worth it. I got it on sale for 37 cents or so, thanks to Steam. 500% shield. No, now it's back down to 100%. I might start a series of this game. Aw, my cheaty button doesn't work on this. Oh well. To anyone wondering, my controller does have the mock button on it. It lets me do rapid fire on like games of Call of Duty. I don't use it on Call of Duty or anything like that. I mean like I did once against one of my friends. It was pretty funny. Post in the comments if you want me to do this story in a different video or something. Because it's a kind of a funny story. Anyways. So... To explain how, like, this game feels, it's not like glidey to where you have, like, really firm movements. I wish it was controlled by the mouse, because that would be so much more, like, easy. You can probably increase the sensitivity of your ship inside of settings or so. The game's kind of fun, I guess. I'm kidding, it's fun. I am enjoying myself. It's kinda difficult. Level 3. Oh, I can see the level difference on the weapons. Here, I'll play uh, before and after.
Now, it looks like we're fighting a boss or something. I'm not really paying attention to the bullets. I'm just kind of moving around, hoping that I dodge them. So, if that doesn't say much, then I don't know what will. All you really have to do is move around and they can't hit you. I guess this is my lucky ship. Space Jet Extreme is my lucky ship of power! He flies around at Mach 10 and he has bullets that pierce through the stars. I like the 3D environment though. I think they get a, did a good job on that. It doesn't make you feel like you're in the game, like you know that it's just a 2D shooter, but it gives you something to look at if you get bored. Which I'm not, to be honest. I'm having a blast. Oh gosh! See? A blast. Literally. An explosive experience. 500% shield. I wish they didn't have that pop up if you really don't go up by 500%. Oh gosh, I can't move. There we go. I was moving my chair. One sec. And we're back! I moved my chair a little bit. I'm closer to the mic and now my headset is in my way. Oh gosh, and just at the start of the third level and I'm already up against the boss. And this guy doesn't seem to be taking anything easy on me. Can I do rapid fire on the missiles? Oh yeah. yeah. Just wait till I'm out of missiles. I can't do my like shaky thing. Otherwise I make noise, which is not good. Okay. Let's kind of try to avoid all shots. No damage run! Put that inside of the tag. No damage run survivor. Oh gosh, look at those shots. Okay, game developer, if you ever see this episode, please work on those shots. Just take a second and look at them. All they do is glow and they look so, like... They are unanimated. They don't have a fiery effect or anything. Now, you probably could have done a 3D effect, but that would have taken too much work for you. So, if you ever do see this video, please update your game and make 3D effects on all of your shots. And don't die, please. Don't shoot me. I am a poor ship. Oh gosh. I didn't say a bad word, I said ship. I could have said a bad word though if someone takes it out of context. Rapid fire m missiles and shots, yay, wins. Level complete. Oh, I didn't fully repair. Loading! What's it loading? The next level? Yay, fun. Okay, it looks like we're up against a totally new type of enemy. That will be called the Star... Star Ships. I'm sorry about all background noise. I'll try and cut out my voice if any happens. I've been recording for 22 minutes. Come on, don't die! Suicide! See? Suicide always is an option. Okay, now let's try out a different ship. I don't want to continue. New game. Survivor. Continue anyway. Easy. Which ones have we not done yet? We haven't done this one. Split type. <gasps> they have homing shots! Oh my gosh! 
This is awesome. They're really hard to hit with, though. <gasps> the missiles are homing, too. Fight with the power of the aura. I'm sorry if I go really quiet, it's just because I'm concentrating on not getting hit. Which I've already been hit, like, many times already. Did my shooting speed just go up? Just making sure this thing's working. Okay, this is the shooting speed without my macro on. This is it with my macro on. There is a slight shooting speed increase, so I'll be using the macro. I know I'm cheating. Giggles. Cheating fun in games. Cheating in a Starfighter game. That's the title of this video. Cheating explosions and guns and glory. And our shields up. I'm kidding, I'm not going to be using the macro. It's a little bit cheatsy. A little too cheatsy in my opinion. Oh gosh, look at all of the explosions and points and doodles and D dots. Oh, gosh. Wait, do these split shots pierce? No. Yes. Yes, no. I think they do. Maybe they have a certain amount of damage that they do. Yeah, I think it's a damage type deal. Well, we beat this level. We're full health again I think this is going to be our last round post in the comments if you want to see another episode of this after I die if I do die then we'll do like I'll end off the video and then we'll go off from there oh gosh I just got really lucky I had to scratch my head Oh gosh, look at those ships. Oh my gosh, they're attacking. It's Attack on Titan. I'm sorry, there's a fool in the background. This video is not going to be really edited too much, so... Sorry if you guys don't like that kind of stuff. But I personally don't like having the edit so much. Because it makes it easier on the rendering. Actually, no, it makes it harder on the rendering. Whatever. I'll just edit what I have to edit. Deal with it. Oh, I gained another level. Post in the comments if you noticed me get stronger. Oh, this boss is going to be easy with this. <laughs> down, up, up, down, up, down, down, left, right, up. Oh my goodness. Oh gosh. Oh, I shot a missile right after it died. Destroy everything! Space Defender powers activate! I am super powerful! I have no clue what the story is of this thing. Why am I killing these people? They're probably innocent, and I'm just sitting here blowing everything up. I am going to town on this place. Look at everything. 
Look at all of the destruction. Look at it all. Post in the comments if you can count how many people you estimate I kill. Just post down a guess. I'm guessing I killed above a million just doing that. I'm pretty sure this is another boss fight. Can I destroy this lamppost? No? Yes? Oh no, this isn't a boss fight. This is just a normal level. Let's do a circle thingy. Oh yes, yes it is a boss fight that I thought it was. Explosions! Damage! Destruction! Mayhem! Carnage! I'm sorry, I'm running out of words. Job done there. Tango down. Can we destroy all of these? They look so like PNG files. I could probably edit them to have like Voldemort faces. Oh no, look, it's Lord Voldemort! Oh my god! I'm kidding, I'm not going to edit that in. That's going to take way too much effort. Or did I? Or didn't I? Post in the comments if I did or didn't. Post in the comments if you can find the hidden Voldemort face. I'm going to hide one at one random part in this video. And you guys gotta tell me if you see it. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Special delivery of food has arrived. I think it's a sandwich. Real life situations while playing video games and recording. You see, I'm a good YouTuber. I'm good at my job. Even though it's not my job. I wish it was. Anyways, that's going to be all for this episode. If you liked it, then please be sure to comment down below what was your favorite part of the episode. And if you stuck through all this time, please comment down below where you found Lord Voldemort. See all you guys in the next episode. Bye!